unexpectedly, it has something to do with NSARS. The music star Simi has kicked against a government request to dialogue with representatives from the NSARS protest. The music star made this known via Twitter on Monday. She said instead, the government should address all Nigerians in a press conference. She added that if protesters chose representatives, they will bear the responsibility of the outcome of the movement. Since the government asked Nigerians to send their representatives to dialogue with them over the protest, many have resisted the move, saying, quote, we have no leader. Yes, and of course, uh, joining us to quickly share her thoughts on this is Plus TV Africa's Ife Omai. Hello. Hey. Thank Good you morning. for having me. So we're just wearing red. <laughs> Coincidence. <laughs> That's true. How did you to get red. to the office this morning? Um, we understand the situation at Lekki wasn't really good. Yes, I, we were very lucky because it was in the inception of the blockage, so we were able to maneuver our way out. But people are getting a lot more agitated. I think the death of people are not helping. Um, the response is not helping either. So. People are taking laws into their own hands at this point. Because I wasn't even sure if it was about NSARS. They were not really well, was, chanting yeah. NSARS anymore. So it I don't know what like their it. plights are at this point, personally. Like Let, yeah. Let's talk about Simi. And I also saw, what's his name now? Balogun, one of the former Big Brother Ninja housemates. Um, Sir Leo, I think. Okay. Leo, yeah. Um, also made mention of something similar. The... Um, artists in Nigeria, entertainment and celebrities, mm. you know, and the rest getting involved in conversations like this. It's not mm. really where you normally find them. Um, but he basically was calling out those who have chosen to, to stay silent uh, because, it, you know, they don't want it to affect their paychecks and affect, mm. you know, possible gigs that they might get in the future. Um, so what, do, what are your thoughts on getting involved as an, enter, as an entertainer? I think... I think there is a responsibility for entertainers in this plight because we are the most hit. Creatives are not necessarily um, the fit-in-the-box type of people, even with um, appearances. A lot of our creatives have dreadlocks and fit the category that are usually stigmatized by these um, special force. So I, I know that we are we're greatly affected by that, so it would be very hard for me to understand why um, an artist in this country would not share the same, um, you know, plight as others in regards to the NSARS movement. But I don't think everyone needs to join in the way that we are assuming. So even if you don't go out to protest or you don't use it online, doesn't mean that you cannot donate to the cause or help, ga help gather resources. There's ways where you can feel comfortable and still um, have you know, have contributions to the, if to I'm, the movement. We're told we have just a one minute left, okay. so I'll just ask you in 30 seconds, okay. what is the response on social media to Simi's position? I think we all agree to that. We have a very big issue with trust in regards to the youth and the government. And if you have one face and it's easy to dismantle the whole thing, one if, either by threat to the president's life or even by corruption. So if it's if you can't pinpoint this protest to one person, then it's harder to break the unity that we have. So I'm with her on it and I think majority of the social media um, protesters are also with her on that. Thank you very, very much for coming on the breakfast this morning. Thank you for having me.